Hello, everybody. Welcome back to E4 Multiplayer. You know what the... Well, you know what's up. This is, you know what's happening. That was, that was a great intro, new best friend. If you don't know what's happening, then go back to the start of the series and watch it there, or just go back an episode or two, whatever it is you've missed. So, for those who are upset that uh, maybe the whole new best friend thing's happening, I would just remind you all that uh, I don't think they have the written word in Magnu. I think it's like oral tradition, so they, they probably yeah, don't remember um, very accurately. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, yes, our slave eyed saviors have come. Oh, boy. <laughs> Oh god, why? How is it that all of my videos get flagged except for the Bell Pirates? I don't understand. <laughs> and we're pretty <laughs> awful in this. We say a lot of terrible things. To be fair, we say a lot of, I mean, we say a lot of terrible things all the time. It's just it's recorded now. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's not wrong. We'll do it in our lives later on. You're like, you're like in our mid-40s or something. Oh. It's like, we watched this video of you, sir. <laughs> They did it again. They just pieced out of another war. You said, and I quote, slanty-eyed bastards. <laughs> Slant <laughs> slanty-eyed saviors, not bastards. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's what Bob says. It's just like, excuse me, sir. It was actually, <laughs> it's actually saviors. <laughs> Let the records show. All right, let's try evening out these arts. Yeah, that's a little bit. Even those are. Oh, why did my income just take a nosedive suddenly? Where's my other army? So long, Pope Army. Yeah, that was a bad call. It's <laughs> like there was like two two hundred thousand troops nearby, and he's like, "I'm gonna go punch that guy." Oh no. Who's the biggest guy here? Yeah. Yeah. Gotta show dominance. First day, it's like prison. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be like prison for him very soon here. 300 years later. I'm still gonna do it. It's taken him a while to work up the courage. Yes, build more ships. I need a navy. Where did Mordor? Uh, I think we already went over this. Mordor's landlocked. Good, good. He's learned. <laughs> Picked up on a few things. Nope. Picked up on a couple things. Just a few. That was a quick war. Take advantage now while he's weak. He's not weak though. Sorry. He's not. He's not that weak. Now he still has. He, he still has. He didn't really. He didn't really fight us. He just sort of like he had one battle where we wrecked him, and then he's like, oh, "Not right, the face." Corner. Five thousand two hundred thirty-eight gold later. Five thousand gold. What happened? I embraced the thing finally. Oh god. Oh, you, it cost you five thousand gold. Yeah, but the cool thing is I was able to tech up twice and like admin Shit. tech. Oh yeah. <laughs> and that's what happened to me too. I was sitting on. Oh, someone died. Oh, I lost a good <laughs> that's a weird place to sit. I lost a good leader and I got a three zero two. Because yeah, the Pal Vikings peaced out in North America, I'm still at war with the Powhatan, and I cannot take any of their territories because I'm not in coring range, despite them being right next to my colony. That little like two province doodle. Yeah, they have caused me so many problems. It's unreal. I can vassalize them, I guess. And then eat them later. Develop all the salt provinces. Hey, that's that. my job. So I have I've had people commenting that are going, you've got the salt tuned in pretty good. Just the perfect amount of salt these days. <laughs> well, it's because e, it's because EU4 isn't as broken as other games that you play with. Are they salt. are they using this series as as the bar? No, because if that's true, then you're gonna have a very short lifespan. <laughs> uh, talking more about Hoy. Oh. Wait, Hoy 4 or Hoy 3 or... 4. I I had a really salty episode uh, yesterday. Because of, because of a peace conference. <laughs> as, as... Like you do. Like you do. Well, like, what happened was, uh, I was playing as Germany. 
and I, I, I was at war with the Commutards. And um, the last thing I needed to take was Britain. And I ended up doing this really hard fought landing and a lot of fun. Uh, and, you know, like I had two failed landings before I had one successful one. And it was, you know, back and forth and back and forth. And we eventually got them out of beat them. And then after the war ended, uh, Canada took, got to take everything. And I was like, what the fuck is up with this? Why does Canada get everything at the end of this war? And then I realized that Canada had been at war with the, the communist states as well. Hadn't done anything. Hadn't done anything at all, but was at war with them. So the both wars got merged in the same peace conference. And then for some reason that nobody can understand, that, that nobody can understand and nobody uh, you, know, you know can explain adequately to me, Russia, who didn't fire a single shot in the like eight years of war, who had zero war participation, had zero casualties, did literally nothing the entire time, got all of the war score, and then gave all of the war score to Canada. So at the end of all that conflict, I ended up with nothing because Russia somehow ended up with the war score, gave it to Canada, that Canada took nothing. I, I just was... realized I did something really stupid. I was going for the uh, large capital, 50 development in the capital. I was boosting the development in London. It's not my capital. <laughs> God. Whoops. Slightly annoying. Why don't you just move your capital there, then? Yeah. <laughs> At this point, it's probably worth it. Remind me, late like this time of the game, what's the best CB to use? Is it still claims, Imperial. or is it Imperial? Imperialism is great, as long as you can get their capital easily. <laughs> yeah, don't be like Ming. Imperialist War in Russia, or who takes St. Petersburg, guys? All right, so imperialism. All right, here we go. Move in, lads. Bavaria? Wow, that's actually... Didn't think you'd go to war with them. Oh, wait. No, oh, you're bringing in France. <laughs> Never mind. Well, I'm, I'm only bringing in France to deal with Aragon, because I, I, really, I can't really reach them. I can take Bavaria solo easy. You're a pussy, Bavaria. They really are. I mean, they only have like 100,000 troops, so I'm not super worried about them. But yeah. I'm mean, taking a look at all these Catholics in the, in, in the New World. St stupid Catholics. I ah, exactly. They don't proper, properly worship my horses. Where are you going, French troops? What the hell? I got the north covered, thanks. Naval force limit of 300. Don't mind if I do. I'm sorry, what now? 300. I think that is a third of that right now. Uh, I am 190. Yeah, someone said they hadn't started building uh, shipyards and things, and I realized I haven't either. That, that was me. You're yeah. welcome. Thank mm -hmm. you. <laughs> See, my cap is... I have 105 of 113 right now. 219 of 300. Ah, truce is over with Mexico. Did you want to punch him again, Ben? Revolution, oh, in, Revolution in Russia. Did you want to punch him again, Ben? I'd be okay with that. Go get him. Oh, wait, so we have a revolutionary Russia now? Or... The revolution in Russia. Okay, so, alright. That's the same thing. Gonna say that would be bad. Well, I don't know. Does uh being revolutionary does that uh does that come with uh like uh certain benefits? I've never actually played as one. Government, uh, you get a nice government, right? <laughs> I hear you get a nice government. This it's pretty fine. Is your government nice? nice? Ming hates me so much, but I'm their biggest tributary, so there's no objection they can do. <laughs> it's, it's, it's almost like the tributary system is fucked. No, don't go that way. Jesus. Oh, France, what are you doing? Screw oh, wow. you, Mexi Mexi oh my God. Mexitards? Let's go with that. 29,000 <laughs> 29, French just attacked 50,000 Bavarians in one. What? Strong, strong. 
Yeah, wow. I'm telling Those you, France is long and strong. France is scary as shit. Well, to be fair, they are military tech 27 right now. Yeah, but I think they also have, like, ideals that are really good for um, this stuff. I just don't remember where to find that. They have offensive that. ideas, quality ideas, plus they have their own national ideas. So, yeah, they're... Yeah, offensive quality, and they're, t- they're one of the highest and military French. Tech. Yeah, they're, they're scary. French ambition. Long. Yeah, yeah Fr- France could get some really high morale in their... It doesn't hurt the fact that they also control half of Iberia, so they also have the manpower from there. <laughs> Mexico's begging for mercy now. Like, no, please, no, not the Mongols again. Don't do it. Not the face. All these horses. <laughs> What's wrong with horses? Well, other than they're embedded in walls, not much. <laughs> <laughs> you don't tell me what to do with my horses. Yeah. We revere them so much, we we build with them. <laughs> exactly. Even wooden ones? Mm, no, I prefer their bodies. Their actual carcasses. They're good stuff. Oh, God. I regret everything. <laughs> oh, man, I missed him. Marital bliss? Don't mind if I do. Bastard. I have the best bliss. I have all the bliss. Yeah, what now? Is that like a a new street drug or some shit? Marital bliss. (laughs) How'd you say that? Marital bliss. How'd you say that, Nems? It sounds like a drug from Dread. Or from Judge Dread. Yeah, that. I've actually been reading the comics lately. Very good. Never read them before. Well, I just got a mission. Russia, you should make Russia like you. Uh, we've had issues in the past. Oh, big fight, big fight. Get out of here, shitbag. <laughs> Die, Mexico! Been a thorn in my side for too long! You will be tolerated no more! Mm hmm. We have won the siege of Waco. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Not kidding! Can't siege all, I only have 30,000 troops in that province. <laughs> you probably won it because there wasn't a flashbang this time, so. <laughs> or was it a smoke grenade? Boo doo boo doo. All two Mexican light ships are over here. Look out! Both of them. Uh oh. GG. Good knowing you. France, where are your troops, home, skills, home slice? You, uh. I'm gonna see like 30,000 of them. Oh, God, Commonwealth, why are you doing this? They're already. You've already hit them so much. <laughs> the combos at war with Ottomans. Stop hitting him, he's already dead. Now, who wants to see Does anybody else think there needs to be a much better way to uh, assign parliament seats than individually clicking on territories than clicking on the button in the in the UI? Everybody but Paradox. It would be nice if it was better, yes. Like, if it, just, like the, if you, if it was set up oh, the shit. way that uh, um, estates are set up, where you just click click this and then assign, 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 assign. Damn you, Bavaria, for putting up a fight. How dare you. <laughs> That's right, I am. I got, I got 99% war score. Wait, I could, I could do my own peace deal here. Ah! I'm in charge now! <laughs> wait a minute, so you're gonna piece out Mexico and just leave me to now and then try to deal with them? Oh, wait, I forgot, <laughs> I forgot about that. Sorry, Bob! All on you! Oh, you're my best friend, according to oral tradition. When we used to give you oral hey, love. I would say that, I, I would just say that if you did do something like that, you're in my way. <laughs> <laughs> He's not wrong. <laughs> 
All right, do do your thing, Bob. Divine guidance, gain stability. Uh, we'll go ahead and siege up all that stuff that's also in the like the from Texas and all that there too. Yeah. Conversion successful. Damn straight. <laughs> I know you want peace, Mexico, but you're gonna have to wait until more of you are dead. <laughs> <laughs> No peace for you. That's how it works. Yes, be gone, Catholics. Also, Protestants. I've got so many merchants, I don't know what to do with them. I have nine merchants. That's a nice problem to have. I, I you know, it is. Uh, admittedly, I, I, I've engineered the New World's trade nodes so that I'm getting the maximum <laughs> profit. By just having one merchant in each node. But, uh, yeah, it's... I have one that I don't know where to put him. <laughs> Nobody's seen France's troops anywhere? Anybody? Oh, there they are. They're in fucking Seville, of course. 84,000 French stuck in Seville. Oh, it used to be upwards of almost 200,000, but then they've been just slowly dying in Seville. <laughs> I've just been chasing this one Mexican army around all across America for this entire war. <laughs> I've just become a kingdom. Yes! Reach, reach for the stars, Morgan. 17 for the stars. Oh, I am no longer a duchy. Love I, had to, I had to ask Castile for uh, access because France apparently is too dumb to do that. <laughs> Or they've pissed them off way too much. One of the oh, two. no, that that's a thing right now in, in Hoi 4. The AI is not smart enough to uh, get military access from its neighbors, so you can effectively cock-block alliances pretty easily. Now, to be fair, like, access in Hoi 4 is pretty broken. <laughs> yeah. Well, it was, it was when forts got an area of influence was what messed it up, because it used to be all right, at least partially. Like, it worked. But when they added in four area of influence, that's when it you, started breaking things. Did you use air quotes when you said worked? Or... <laughs> well, if I didn't already have like a drink in my hand, I would have. Oh, that's interesting. For some reason, Ming gave their one province in the New World that I desperately wanted to Mexico. <laughs> that Effort really works into my that works right into my wheelhouse, Ming. Thank you. Maybe it was like a kind of under the table, like, eh, hey, take it. Hey, we're okay. We don't need it. <laughs> we see you got your friends with Bundesfo. You're friends with us. <laughs> There's nothing friendly about the relations between myself and Ming. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you even insinuate such a thing? I don't know, Bob. <laughs> see, I see that tributary status on you. There's okay. nothing friendly about it. They take shit and they're mad at me all the time. Well, that's 100% war score. Huzzah. I can, I can still remember a couple episodes ago, Ben, when you were just like, I don't know if I want to keep doing this. This is... Oh, that was... <laughs> yeah, uh, 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 fucking Neb saved me from that, because when he sent, uh, sent me an alliance offer, everyone was like, maybe we should declare war on him every five years. Good that you remember your Hanseatic friends. Oh, uh, yeah, uh, allies in... in benefactors. Benefactors. Yeah. I think, I think the, uh, whatchamacallit did expire, that's, uh... Well, it, 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 in, all, in all honesty, it was getting extremely uh, frustrating and, and just really unentertaining from, from, from my point of view to just, you know, chain war after chain war after chain war after chain war after chain war. Kansas will now back support restricts import. Oh, okay, that was, that was interesting. Kansas, good for you. Um, it was just getting really frustrating and really boring, and I was just sitting here going, you know what, I can fucking go do something. Uh, I could spend this time doing something more entertaining that'll get more views rather than just sitting here constantly getting shit on. And that's not the right thing. Chance to win 12%. Ignore corruption. Yeah, go for it. Bribe. Bribe. <laughs> okay, so 
a couple of episodes ago, I was saying that Letters of Mark wasn't working, so the offensive and exploration idea policy, it does. You just have to have completed one of the ideas for it to actually appear. Get there, France. Oh, too late. So things not broken. Much happy. Much happy. Oh, wow. Much yeah. <laughs> yes, convert everybody. All Catholics must die. What? I... That's not what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Trans-Siberian Magister declared war on Europe. <laughs> yeah, but it, it did not go well for Protestants hold, this, hold my beer. this timeline. <laughs> what are you saying? The Protestants are doing very well. Well, in one place. In only one place. Okay, two, two places. places. <laughs> but Brandenburg <laughs> is kind of a... Somebody's right now. Other than... I might have I might have purged that except for everyone except Brandenburg in northern Germany, maybe. I think the funniest thing is that Reformed still somehow exists as a as a uniformed religion, uh, and it's only because Bavaria is strong. <laughs> oh my my dunce of a ruler died! Huzzah. Well, it was strong. I, at this point, I'm not sure. I haven't looked up there in a while. <laughs> That actually well, works right into my wheelhouse as well, because the, the queen consort hates Catholics. France just peaced out of my war. Because they were inept and didn't leave Seville. Yes, I know there's going to be rebels. I'm prepared. I have prepared to defend myself. Heck, let's, let's do this. I have a plan for Bavaria. Dear Bavaria. Is it to integrate them into a unified German state? Well, first of all, it's to punch them right in their nuts. Step one. Send 150,000 against 50. <laughs> okay, that worked out well. Really? I wouldn't have guessed. <laughs> yeah, that's... Completely alien. Didn't think that would have happened. <laughs> fake news. Fake news. <laughs> Step uh, two. Well, this is a long, longer battle than I thought it would be. There we go. <laughs> Uprising in Mexico. Really? Oh, they they rose up directly underneath my troops. That was not not intelligent. <laughs> You, you escaped, you tricky bastard. You so bitch. You so bitch. All right, this is gonna stop. All right. Deck twenty-seven. That's this a lot of tech. Yes, conversion in Honduras. Convergis. Excuse you. I'm okay. Are you sure? No, no. End of the revolution. Now we have revolutionary Russia. Nope, it's just Russia. No, nope, they crushed it. <laughs> they crushed oh. it. Oh, okay. A bunch of revolutionaries did appear in my colonies too, but they were killed, eradicated. eradicated. <laughs> that is room. <laughs> when you we, usually we put a pause the there. Limitations. When you usually put a pause there, Mordrin, you usually use something less, <laughs> less <laughs> nasty. <laughs> Like they've been dealt oh, with, you say, <laughs> but, but no, no pale pirates straight to it. No, we killed the shit out of them. <laughs> <laughs> and what's more, I enjoyed it. <laughs> well, thank you for watching this episode of Morgan <laughs> genocides the shit out of things. Hope you're enjoying the series. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Go check out the other perspectives. You can go check out our Patreon pages if you like support with more than just a view. And we'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye. Bye. 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 Bye.